Hello again, everyone. Welcome back. And we are going to go back to the beach, but uh, sometimes in production, things happen. And the entire first segment that I filmed did not have any sound. So I'm going to do it this way. We're going to rejoin it in progress when we cut the cigar. Now, today we are reviewing the counterpart to yesterday's new Perdomo 10th anniversary Maduro. This is the Sun Grown. 6x54, just like yesterday, box pressed. There is your density. Has an average feel in the hand. I love these new bands. The blue band yesterday and the red band on this uh, Sun Grown is spectacular. Too bad you can't smoke the band, but I like the band. Now, this is all Nicaraguan. Um, complete information on the blog as far as what it's going to replace and what have you but uh, these are brand new from Nick Perdomo and the gang in Esteli so let's get right to it the new Perdomo 10th anniversary sun grown epicure all right this particular one uh, di differs from the Maduro, and it's just probably cigar to cigar. Um, a little more sharper of a box press, but it's still not the sharpest box press I've ever seen. It is box pressed, just not a sharp box press. All right, good draw with just a touch of firmness to it. The first flavors are nice cedar with some light citrus influence, more orange peel than anything. A lot of brown sugar, nice cinnamon, light leather, nutmeg, and a black coffee base. Black pepper at about seven. Seven. So that's how you start. Nice sweet start. Pronounced orange peel in there. Combining with that leather, actually, is what a flavor I'm getting. So uh, let's see what we have at the first third. Alrighty, here we are at the first third, as you can see. And basically, it's just like I described when we started. Now, there is a large element of the leathery orange peel uh, mix and the nutmeg sort of joins in but there are a lot of sweet nuts brown sugar has no trouble making its way through those I would call it medium bodied at this point the finish is sort of a citrusy cedar you don't really have so much citrus on the front end you have the orange peel but with the um and a nice little nutmeg lingering black pepper is about average not excessive but it's very good this cigar is very good it's very nice and sweet i'm going to start it off at 94. it's very good very good cigar so let's just Keep moving through and let's see what we have at the uh, second third. So here we are at the end of the second third. And you know those uh, citrus peel notes we talked about and the uh, leather, they started starting to move up. And the sweetness has decreased a little bit. I still very much enjoy the cigar. It's medium, probably medium to full by now. And uh, finish is basically unchanged. Those citrus notes 
uh, or not citrus notes, but the brown sugar notes decrease just enough that uh, all I'm going to do is lower the score to 93. But it's still, it's a, it's a, it was enough to make the move. So um, with one third left, the cigar is very good. And uh, I really like the leather notes. I'm just reporting that there's a little dip in the sweetness and the elevation of the uh, orange peel and the leather. And I guess you could say nutmeg too. So let's just see what we have in the final third. Well, we're down to the end, so let's wrap it up. But first, as a point of reference, here's our room. And uh, you can see it's about where I'm sitting directly in front of me, <clears throat> the beach behind me. And you can see the uh, beautiful long seven mile beach that we are on. It just sort of goes and goes and goes. Now, as far as the cigar, the lowered sweetness that we talked about in the second third sort of bounced back. Uh, same flavor notes across the board. Medium to full bodied, really leaning a little toward full. The finish is basically unchanged. But this has been a very good cigar. For the final third, I would bump it back to 94. Very good. Another good cigar that Nick has come out with. So your overall score is 93.67, which if memory serves me correctly, is one point lower than a Maduro, but that's a preference type thing. Now, a Maduro is extremely nice and sweet. This one is very sweet, but uh, the Maduro is a little sweeter, but it's very good. Very good cigar. So that'll do it from here in the grill, Jamaica, at the Couples Swept Away Resort. The new Perdomo 10th Anniversary Sun Grown Epicure, 93.67.